Sometimes I like to confront them head on just because I like to not expose people, but just I don't think negative comments are necessary. I think 2020 for me has been exactly the same as everyone else. It's not been the best, not being able to see my family. Um, it's been tough, but here we are. I'm healthy, I'm healthy, and I'm here, and I'm working, so I'm happy. <laughs> um, my go-to look <laughs> for the whole of lockdown, all I was in was joggers, hoodies, anything baggy, anything comfortable. That was my go-to look. No makeup, hair not done, and yeah, that's how I was chilling. I think it's important for me because I value my platform and my followers and I really want to be honest with them about what goes on and I know it's relatable to a lot of people. Um, and yeah, just being honest, um, like I'm a real life person and the same things that everyone else goes through, I do too, and I want to be as transparent as I possibly can be. That's sort of a funny one for me personally, just because I think everyone's entitled to do whatever they want to do and whatever makes them happy, but for me personally, I just like to share my honest truth with everyone. I think that's important for everyone to do, but I'm not judgmental of people that want to edit the photos because I, I know why they do it, <laughs> why they would want to do it. Depends on how I'm feeling on the day. Sometimes I like to confront them head on just because I like to not expose people, but just I don't think negative comments are necessary. So just kind of put people back in that place. And then sometimes I ignore it um, because I'm so busy and I've got better things to do, but it's not nice either way. My advice would be to go out and exercise because you don't realise how much good it does for your body until you're doing it. I was finding it really easy to be lazy, but then that shift doing exercise really um, brought back my positive mental attitude and self, like self-image. <laughs> I definitely believe in self-love and that can come in so many forms, like getting myself a designer pair of shoes or a bag or having a nice hot bath or going for a massage or getting my nails done or getting my hair done. There's so many things that you can do in the name of self-care. Um, but yeah, just anything that makes you feel happy, definitely believe in it. Well, it's tough because I can't really say everything that's going on in 2021, but there is a lot of things and a lot of interesting things and a lot of different things that I've not done before, but it's very, it's looking very busy and very exciting.